hello guys and welcome to yet another wonderful edition of my youtube channel fast giddy my name remains richard N, and today we're going to be looking at a very important uh powerful tool that can help you uh save call costs uh when you manage your businesses when you want to re maybe relate with your customers and all of that this is a perfect tool if you are into code calling and all of that if you manage your business over the cloud and then you want to get a phone number to be able to reach out to your con to your contacts to your customers maybe you want to resolve customer complaints customer service and all of that this is a very very powerful tool for you and it's called call hippo call hippo as you can see right here is the leading virtual phone system that assists in increasing agent productivity, automating workflows, tracking team performance, as well as reducing uh, communication costs. What it means is that with this call hippo, you don't have to have this phone physically. It doesn't have to be a physical phone, maybe an iPhone, maybe an Android device, maybe a Samsung or whatever. You just have to manage it over your laptop over your system maybe across your mobile phone you can just log in to call hippo and then be able to reach out maybe respond to calls and all of that so let's get to knowing how to use and deploy this call hippo for our business so how do you get a call hippo phone number how do you sign up for a call hippo account in order for you to be able to sign up for a call hippo account the first thing you want to do is to first of all open the call hippo website call hippo.com and uh, when you get onto callhippo.com, you're going to find on the very home page here, you're going to find something like try call hippo free. This is where everything begins. When you click on call, try call hippo free, it's going to open you up to the sign up page. And at this sign up page, the first thing you might want to do here is to want to maybe work with your regular email, which could be a Yahoo mail, maybe a Gmail, maybe an Outlook, and all of that. So uh, but I'll be sorry to disappoint you because Call Hippo does not like those kind of emails. So if I want to try something like fastgd at gmail.com and I click on start trial, it's not going to work because the company has a policy against these regular emails or let me say generic domain. So what it wants is that you generate a custom domain, um, I mean a custom email with your business domain. So what this means is that if your business website was like, uh, let's say, AkuraWebHost.com, you might want to go and generate an email like info at AkuraWebHost.com and then come here to you know to use that email to sign up for this account because if you don't do this, they're not going to let you in. So how do you get a custom email for your business? What you can do and the fastest way to do this is if your maybe if your web admin or maybe your server hosting is not that really available, what you can do is take this your email and then simply go to uh, workspace workspace.google.com. This is workspace.google.com. You know here you can be able to to sign up for a custom email using your existing. A domain name you just have to enter the business name enter how many people work for you and all of that in your country and then you'll be able to generate an email with your domain so it, so it's so it's going to be something like maybe info at your domain name.com maybe for instance maybe info at uh maybe this maybe say digital business.com and with that you can simply just come here you can come here and then you can just enter it so i'm going to enter one now i'm going to enter support support at praisedrops.com. So when you start it like this, it's going to be accepted and then you just have to solve the capture. And then when you finish solving the capture, it's going to take you in and then you can create an account and start enjoying the benefit of this uh, amazing uh, tool that saves so much cost in business management. So this is how to do this. And then the moment you are done sending that, the moment you are done uh the moment you are done entering your custom email what you have to do is you come to the email address and then you are going to get a verification link this is a verification link as a button and this is the same link as a you know just as a naked link here so you want to click on it when you click on this uh link it's going to take you to where you're going to verify your account and then it means you have verified your account and then after verifying your account you can then be ushered into the call hippo dashboard so this is the call hippo dashboard so don't forget your 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 normal regular email account like gmail yahoo mail outlook and you know whatsoever 
will not work. So you have to generate a custom email with your domain name. So if you don't have a domain name, you might want to try google.com, you want to try Namecheap, you might want to try other things, InterServer, and all of that, just to buy your domain. It doesn't cost much. On the link below, on the description, I'm going to add uh, you know, a link for you to buy a domain name and possibly buy a host if you feel like it. So don't forget to click on it to be able to get that easily done. So now let's go back. So if you are done doing this, you're going to be ushered into the into the dashboard. This is the call hippo dashboard. And in the call hippo dashboard is divided into the, the main dashboard, which is where you see all that has been happening in your in your business online here. And then you're going to see the number and DID. This number and DID is where you see every number you have uh you know maybe purchased are assigned to your partners and teammates and all of that and then, you, and then you're going to have user and performance and this user section you are able to like see those that have access to this account you can see the teams you manage you can see your leaderboard and all of that and then you have your targets and achievements that you set for the team and then you have call reminder which i love so much this is a feature that allows you to actually uh, maybe plan calls before you actually get to make them and then you have call scripts these are more like templates for different departments within your business how they respond to customers or what they should say when they call so then we have campaign management this one is if you want to actually maybe maybe you want to maybe for code calling and all of that this is where you handle all of that and then we have integrations the integration part on call hippo allows you to bring other platforms into the system that can help you achieve things or tasks that call hippo could not actually do on its own and then we have call logs slash recordings the call logs slash recordings actually is where you see all that has been going on here okay what calls happened and were they recorded who you can see the number that was called you can see a user you can see the client and you can see the status is it a completed call you can see here is it a, a no answer call is it a cancelled call is it an ivr is it a voicemail was the complaint unavailable was the call rejected or did it fail and you can see how the time of call and then how long the call took and then what was recorded is it a voice note like did any audio get recorded during the call you're going to see all of that at this call logs slash recording section and then we have the sms slash mms section this is where every message that was sent to your call hippo phone number is displayed so this means with call hippo you get to generate a phone number and with the phone number you can receive sms you can receive mms as well and all of that and then we have the we have the report section this is where we see call status report like okay the calls you've been making uh what were they like how many were you know how many were received or how many were answered you know properly and all of that and then we have the dialer i love this dialer so much because it is very 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 good it's a very very great tool if you really really uh, want to uh, use this so this is where you upload everything and then from here you can actually use it to dial whoever you want to call and then mind you that call hippo actually is a platform that allows you to do so many things it's not just about calls it has its crm feature it has uh it has a sales uh feature that allows you to in fact it allows you to do several things you know you know in your business and then one thing i really want to know is to show you how to buy a number on call hippo so how do you buy a number on call hippo in order to buy a number on call hippo this could be a number from any country what you have to do is you go to the number did section and at this section you want to click on numbers when you click on numbers this is your dashboard for numbers now this place shows you every number that you've purchased uh in your call hippo account it shows you also the deleted numbers and then it shows you also the port in request so let's focus on the active numbers where we can actually so this is an existing number i got this a few hours ago so i just want to demonstrate this so that uh those that are new to the system can actually learn how it is done so how do you buy a, a phone number on call hippo in order to buy a phone number on call hippo what you have to do is you click on add number when you click on add number it shows you to select the country where you want the number to be so which country number do you want of course everybody wants to have a us phone number but that depends you might be one looking for a canada number an indian number germany or saudi arabia australia and the rest of them you can see we have so many countries here you are allowed to select from all of this and while you are within the trial version this will you can actually generate this and use for free and even get to give you 20 free calling minutes we would to get your customers and all of that so let's assume i want a us number so i'm going to click on the us as a country and then when i do that 
I am going to have to select which kind of number I want. And of course, I love this number. So you see, this shows us what we can actually do with this number. And it says we can make a voice call, we can make an SMS, we can make an MMS and all of that. It said to use this service, you must submit a to p registration and pay recurring charge of $15 every month. Please use the search option to change the location. But I just want to go ahead since we're on trial version. So you see, I have reached a whatever, whatever. So let's assume we just got that number now. So we can actually go back and then this is our number. And then this is the number we're going to be using for our business. So this is our number and then we can actually start making calls with this right away if everything were um, okay so let's assume you want to make call now we could come here and then we could start making call what you have to do is to open a dialer when you open a dialer this is your dialer here and then you want to just enter the number you want to call so let's assume I want to call um, let's assume I want to call a number so i want to put the country code which is plus two three four and then i want to uh call uh, two three four seven zero three five five then two eight then three two nine and then you can actually call with this please make sure your microphone permission are properly enabled so i can allow this now so when i allow this it means my call people can then make the call for me so i am already calling this number Okay. okay so this simply means that this phone at the moment is not able to to make calls because we need to put credits so in order to be able to put credits we need to come back here and then put credits um that will be a video for another time but for now i just wanted us to, to, to know how to actually get to buy a number on um, um call hippo and then be able to use that for our business so this is so inter interesting guys so if you are if you are looking for a call hippo uh, tutorial for beginners if you're looking for if you're a new person that's trying to understand how call hippo works i think this is the right video for you so remember that this is our channel we'll call it fast giddy tutorials and i would encourage you to really uh, keep a date with us like the channel subscribe and then share our, our videos as we are going to make excellent more interesting awesome content to show, showing you how to use different tools different system out there so enjoy, enjoy your day guys so i'll see you in the next video bye, -bye.